Hello, internet and video enthusiasts. I'm Nick Sanders. Welcome to my channel, Video Deconstructed. You are watching the very, very absolute first video, and I'm happy you're here. If you hit the subscribe button, you could be one of the first 100 subscribers. This is a quick tutorial on Premiere Pro's auto reframe and how to fix a reframe that gave you a not so great result. Here we go. Select either the timeline or the sequence. Go to sequence menu and select auto reframe sequence. We're going to go with 9x16 for this example, and I'm just going to leave all the defaults. The new sequence is being automatically named the same with the addition of 9x16 appended to the end. You will see the new sequence show up in your project panel in its own folder. There it is. You can see that Premiere has automatically opened this new sequence, and now when we play it, it looks great until the end. So as you might have assumed, Premiere is just auto-generating keyframes. So this clip is an easy fix. Just go to the effects control panel and find where the keyframes go bad. You can see this is the problem and all you need to do is delete this and you're good. If this tutorial was too fast for you, I go over everything in more detail for beginners in my extended tutorial. Just click up in the right hand corner. There should be a link up there. Thanks for watching, and of course, click the subscribe button, hit the bell, click the thumbs up, thumbs down, start clicking on everything below the video for the best results. Save it, share it, show it to your grandchildren, all that good stuff.